Meantime, Texas school districts were to begin reporting COVID-19 cases to the state today. Schools have until September 8th to report cases since the start of the academic year. Uh, the Texas Department of State Health Services will publish cases by districts starting at the end of September. Districts will only, though, have to report cases of COVID-19 that occurred on their campuses, not off campus. And because of a positive COVID case, a Kingsville ISD elementary school has been closed temporarily. School administration, they're telling us a person who was at Harrell Elementary School tested positive for COVID-19. The patient is said to be asymptomatic, but will require to self quarantine or isolate for 10 days. Faculty and staff work from home today and contact tracing is said to be underway by administration officials. The campus has been shut down and will be sanitized as per CDC guidelines. In Banchetti, an update coming down from the school district's athletic director there that a student athlete has tested positive for COVID-19. According to Coach Hermes, the student last participated in the boys' athletic workout program on Monday. Coaches currently notifying parents of the situation per UIL regulations. All areas on campus used by the student are being disinfected. Workouts are said to be moving forward on Monday at 7 a.m. And some startling numbers coming down tonight from Jim Wells County. The county tonight reporting 23 new positive coronavirus cases at last update bringing their county total up to 980. Four of those cases are children under the age of 10 in New Oasis County. The city county health district reporting 124 new COVID-19 cases today, bringing the county's total case count to over 18,600 since the pandemic began. This as the city county is also reporting nine new COVID-19 related deaths today. Four new aces said to be seven men and two women ranging in age from their 40s all the way up to their 80s. We continue to monitor these numbers as they come into us. You can find more stats as well as a county by county breakdown in the cases online or on KIIITV.com.